Welcome back. Jamie Garbett joining us on the show today. She is our sustainability coordinator for the city of Kamloops, doing her best to reduce the carbon footprint on our world. How That's are you? Right. I'm great. Yeah, and yourself? Yes, I'm well, thank you. Enjoying Perfect. the nice weather. Yeah, it's nice uh, out there. It is, you know what? And it lends itself to spending more time outdoors, which means you're going to be doing more things outdoors and taking things with you. Mm -hmm. And that's kind of the topic of today, isn't it? Yeah, we yes. want people to be prepared. So if you're going to be going to the park, make sure you bring your own reusable water bottle. If you're out to, you're going to grab a coffee, remember to bring your reusable coffee mug as well so they can fill it up at the coffee shop. And always bring your reusable bags as and well. look at this so, one. Where can people get their cute. hands on these fun little numbers? Um, so we're going to be handing these out at community events. So our EcoSmart team, they just started up. So they're mm -hmm. going to be handing them out. And we're going to be asking residents to take a pledge to help reduce their waste by... To taking simple actions. So again, just bringing your own uh, bag, your own mug, your own water bottle, and that's going to help you save money and you're going to be doing your part to reduce your waste and help out our environment. So Absolutely. Pretty simple steps. Yes. And you know, I just, there's so many, uh, the plastic bag problem in this world is out of control. It's I don't know how long it's going to take to get it under control. It's really bad. So when we do cleanups um, uh, nationwide, they're actually in the top 12 items that are being littered on our beaches and our rivers. What are the other ones? Uh, the biggest one actually is cigarette butts. That's really? number one. So also beverage containers, um, just for, uh, packaging for, for food, uh, plastic waste, all sorts of stuff. And mm -hmm. plastics are the biggest component of, of litter. So it's just trying to reduce our plastic usage. So if you start with a reusable bag, that's a great step in the right direction. Mm -hmm. So we just want people to start making small changes that they can build upon over the years. Mm -hmm. So this is pretty simple. Um, and yeah, when you make little steps together, if we all make one little step, it adds up as a huge, huge result. Absolutely. What else you got? We got a few more minutes. If you want to promote anything that's going on. Uh, well, I just want to mention too, we like... We have pictures. Yeah, we do. So just to show Thanks, that, that uh, plastic does enter our water stream quite easily because plastic is very light, so it'll blow mm -hmm. into the water system. Um, eventually, when this goes into our river, it'll make its way out to the ocean. And the problem with that is that... Um, Marine life will, specifically turtles, will confuse this as jellyfish. Oh. And then they ingest it, which isn't great. So That's you can see upsetting. right here, one is thinking it's a nice healthy snack, but it's not. That's sad, right? It That's is upsetting. really sad. And so. it doesn't take much to, and what is this? Like, what's going on here? Just to, again, to show you how plastic is very light. So um, if you don't have it in your garbage container, secured properly, when the wind comes, it can blow it around and then it's littering our environment. Is this close to here, what those bags were? Where um, was that? I'm not too sure. I just kind of pulled it off the internet. Okay, so. but it's happening. Yeah, so we're pretty lucky. Um, there's a lot of community members that are taking action. They're adopting a road. They're adopting a trail. They're participating in cleanups. And we're picking up this trash. So every year around Rivers Day, we probably take out about eight uh, like eight big bags of, of waste from Riverside Park. And we do that every single year. So we just need to put a stop to that. So it's just really making sure that your mm -hmm. garbage is contained properly because mm -hmm. when our tippers um, tip your garbage containers, if it's not secured properly, if a wind comes around, which is windy here, uh, it can blow it into the environment and mm -hmm. then it just starts floating around. So, and then there. don't litter. Don't ever litter. Don't litter. It's bad. Absolutely. Right? What so, uh, was the occasion for cleaning up the Lac du Bois grasslands not long ago? They found like a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> it's happening all the like, time. I was involved in a cleanup back probably in 2009 and there's mm -hmm. all sorts of illegal dumping. Mm -hmm. um, people just don't want to pay the tipping fees, which mm -hmm. we usually have a, a free day for you to come to the landfill to tip your your stuff, but usually it's only $5, so it's really not that big of a cost to dump materials, so just make sure you just dump it at the landfill. Mm -hmm. And looking ahead, uh, that usually is in the spring, is it not? Uh, the free day at the dump offhand? Exactly, you know yeah, is, so we, we did have one um, on Earth Day, April 22nd, okay. so. Okay, so the next one won't be for a while anyway. Yeah, but I do encourage everyone to go to our website and mm -hmm. to take the pledge, so we're gonna try to maybe create a little bit of a, a community rivalry. So right now mm. we have quite a few people downtown that have already taken the pledge, um, some people out in West Side. So it's just, again, Good. it's just easy to just go online. So calmups.ca uh, slash BYO um, and be proud that you are actually taking part in this initiative because um, we are going to be asking lots of residents and we'll eventually start asking our businesses in town too to show that we're, we're taking action to make these small steps to huge results. Absolutely. Jamie, mm -hmm. thank you for being here today. Well, Very thanks thorough. for having me. Awesome. BYO, take the pledge. You can go online to do that. Uh, we are back after a quick break. Stay with us.